Hello again, and welcome to another box opening. It is still Saturday. My last package came yesterday, but we filmed it this morning because it kind of came later in the day and we had people over. But I have my son Chase here. He's ready to help again and very excited. He was playing outside and I said, do you want to help mom with a video in opening a box? And he came a running. So I'm a little upset because I'm happy and upset. I had this box, which I was expecting from Canada. And I had another box that I was expecting from Russia. So I thought it was about time maybe the mail should come. So I opened my garage door and this box was delivered right by the garage. So I thought, well, the other one must be in a parcel locker, you know, by, my, by the mailbox community thing. So I went down there and there was no box. So I was pretty upset. I was kind of looking at my phone trying to figure out why, you know, I was doing the tracking number, it wasn't thing. Well, in the meantime, I see this hanging in my door. So what happened is by the time it took me to walk from my house to the mailbox, which seriously is just about a minute and back, he happened to ring the doorbell, assuming it's a he. I wasn't home, and so I missed the baby from Russia. Again, upset, but I guess that just gives me a box to go pick up on Monday, so it's hard when it's the weekend and you have to wait two days as opposed to just one day. So anyways, it looks like Chase is trying to get in, so go ahead and rip some tissue. So we're gonna, we're gonna start in here. He likes to play with the tissue. I mean, what kid doesn't? I like tissue also, but look how sweet. Um, I mean, from the colors, we know it's a girl. I know it's a girl. But I like this blankie, and look at the, the ribbon. So there are a few little goodies hanging out to the side, which is nice, you know. Part of the fun, I think, of the reborn hobby is <laughs> changing and dressing the babies. And I had two boys, so girls are so fun for me because I finally get to do headbands and dresses and all that fun stuff. So this is fleecy and I thought it looked like a Carter. So that's, that's really cute. Um, fleecy. Oh, is that little lambs? Oh no, I think bears. Cute. Lambs, bears, bunnies. I like them all. So let's see. Okay. Okay, this is where I need my son's help, but he's just staring and watching. So it looks like, aw, a cute little hat. It looks like a, like a kitty cat. <laughs> That's cute. I do like the, um, well actually, I like them all in hats. It's, it's cute, but especially more the newborns, the sleepy newborns, I like them in the hats because it just kind of makes them look a little more snugglier and fragile and new. Um, let's see here, something flat, but I can tell already from looking in, I'm assuming it's closed, but you never know until you're in there. Oh yeah, it's a cute little onesie. Chase is pulling the box over, so that's why I'm rotating. But look, here we got the lambs. That's what I was thinking it was at the bottom of the sleeper. It's cute. Okay, okay. He's really ready for that baby. What do you think, see his hands? And he's sitting down at the table here and he's he's digging around seeing if he can find anything oops i kind of like just unwrapped her by <laughs> doing that but look we got a little cute elephant and um i also got my um my ashley baby from her in the past fire came in this cute box but what's funny is the cami rose i opened earlier today is from the same artist but i bought her from the person that bought her from the artist. So now I have three, and if I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but Sweet Mommy's Nest um, out of Canada, Quebec, I believe. Oh, actually, we can know for sure, because here's her little birth certificate. It's Scarlet. And yeah, so Sweet Mommy Nest. So cute. Here's her date of birth, her weight, her length. 19 and I got her Ashley and I was noting that the yeah the scarlet looks very similar but there's just something about these faces on these girls when they're sleepy as much as 
I think I prefer open eye babies. There's something about these babies and their jammies and their hats all wrapped up in their blankets, the little sleepy girls that just melts my heart. Um, so, you know, you can never have too many babies, right? I think my collection is getting a little too big, so I might be doing some box, not box, box packing, I should say, <laughs> videos if I can sell a few of them. But, you know, it's not priority for me right now. I'm just enjoying having all these babies in my collection. They look all cute together. I keep them on shelves, and my twins are in a bassinet. Oh, oh, sweet. Oh, we already kind of saw her face. Oh my gosh, but okay. Well, anyways, here she is. Oh my gosh, and she is a doll. But she does look, she does look a lot like the Ashley cut, but not exactly, but still super cute. And oh, so she is, so this is the first baby I've got that is bald. I don't have any more bald babies. And so it's kind of interesting. I mean, with the girls, I don't think it matters as much because, you know, you can put the bows or the hats on their head, but I really don't mind the bald babies. I mean, because she has, you know, a lot of nice detail on her head. So she's really, really cute. And I really like these jammies. Look, it's got um, owls, just different colored owls. I want some trees. But it's a nice little kind of dusty rose pink color. So we're kind of doing this opposite. We already saw the sweet face. You know, we got to do it Chase's way. Oh, my gosh, look at that. A little oh, cutie pie. I want to see. I mean, we can see her hands here. She's got a fist. And then she's got... Oh, that's cute. I like how sometimes, yeah, like in this case, you know, the Saskia has the pointer finger. She's got the three on the end sticking up. But she's going to look so cute. So <laughs> me next to Ashley. <laughs> Scarlet. And the th thing that's cute, too, my oldest son... Um, Noah, who's helped me with a few videos, but he's not here right now. He's playing with friends. He loves the name Scarlet. Like, it's his favorite name for a girl. He named um, one of our cats Scarlet after we had already named her something else. But he was like, I think the cat's older than he is. So he named her Scarlet because he just liked the name so much. But look at the bottom of her feet. Isn't that cute? And her heels. <laughs> We're just going to have to do this Chase's way. Because he, you know, he's very fascinated with, um, with um, the babies. So, anyways, here we go. My finger got in there again. But I will work on my professionalism one of these days. Get a tripod. Do some changing videos. Just talk about fun stuff. But for now, we're just enjoying opening the boxes. And like I said, I can show you Chase. Yeah, he likes... He likes to pat them. He's very nice. Nice baby. Nice baby. Okay, well, we can't see the baby's face right now. I think he's burping her. Oh, but she didn't eat. Well, we have to feed her, Chase, okay? She had a long journey. So thanks again for watching another box opening video. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a nice weekend. Bye.